Hi, I'm Dan Ivanchow from O'Fallon, Missouri. I actually found Nature's Formula on uh, Facebook, through an ad on Facebook, and uh, got a hold of Faden online and been doing business with them ever since. I think it was, what do we say, it was three years ago? We, we um, 2020. Got connected? Yeah, 2020. Yep, been doing business with Nature's ever since. So this year we did, um, in our corn and milo, we did um, sure grow with plus B and um, P and K on everything in furrow across the board. Um, some of our soybean fields, we um, just did natures with the plus B and other ones we did natures with plus B and P and K as well. Yeah, we shelled corn, uh, we finished Practically finished up this week. Um, really happy with our yields in corn. Um, I was telling Peyton, haven't really put pen to pen, uh, pen to paper yet, but it's looking like 190, 190 average across the boards. Um, we were kind of talking about it that really, really pleased with our ROI so far this year. Um, and the same in the Milo, we just Got into our first field today and um, pretty happy with it. It looks like our return on it is gonna be pretty high as well. Yeah, so our our corn, um, we put 100 pounds of dry up front um, ahead of planting, incorporated it, and um, came back um, later on and top dressed with 50 pounds on it. So really impressed with the 180, 190 uh, yield with only having 100 pounds of nitrogen out there this year and then with the milo that we're here with now um, we had 125 pounds of nitrogen and we half of the field we top dressed with pnk uh, full rate of i believe it was two gallons per acre of pnk and then the other half of the field we did a split apply uh, so we ended up doing uh, one and a half gallons per acre, and then I think he said it was 17 days later we did another one and a half gallons per acre. It seems like that split apply helped us out a little bit, but there's a couple variables in there that we're still not totally sure on. But overall, with our inputs, we're really, really pleased with. Weed harvest, we, um, we actually put down 50 pounds of nitrogen with uh, sure grow plus B and P and K all in one one we just mixed it all in the sprayer and went out um, we had yeah so 50 pounds of nitrogen liquid applied on the on the wheat and ended up with around I think it was around 85 average across the farm so all of our I think we're at 140 acres of wheat this year total and it all got applied exactly the same um, and we ended up 80 85 average across the boards and we were really thrilled really thrilled with that as well and then i know also you grew sunflowers this year we did i don't know a whole bunch about it but um we were averaging around 60 to 70 bushels to the acre on that which um we were really happy with um just kind of a little hobby field but we were we were really thrilled with this year kind of had some um weather issues and had to replant a little bit so i think it could be better but kind of one of those things you can only control so much and what are the beans looking like so far this year so far we're getting really excited we're we're hoping for a, a bumper crop of beans this year we're actually looking at a field right here next to us earlier today and we're really excited to get out there. I'm yeah, hoping for 65, 70 plus bushel out there the way it's looking right now. And now since using the product, we've known each other since 2020 or so, what through the years has just made you, what it, did you see at first, I guess, that most impressed you most and want you to continue using sugar growth? I think our biggest thing at this point is we're not seeing, um, we're not, I'm not seeing that we're mining the fields per se. We're not seeing a lot of drop in the nutrients in the soil. Um, and we're still able to produce 
190 bushel corn. This field that we're in here was about 150 bushel milo. Had a couple um, variables with mother nature, so um, kind of hard to choose this field in particular. Really excited to see the rest of the milo and, and how it does. Um, but overall, with um, removing synthetic P and K totally from our farming practices to still be able in year three to have yields like we are. Um, we're really happy with it and excited to continue our business with nature and the nature's in the future. Um, I would say the, um, honestly, customer service is, is the best. Um, really, really been impressed with everybody at nature's and that they can um, all, everybody there has always been a phone call away. Any questions will be answers when we're working together with Peyton or other, other people at, at Nature's that they're able to answer a question. If they can't, they can get us a, a question answered pretty quickly. Um, and working together with us closely on our soil test and make sure that we're doing everything that we possibly can to not only get the best yield, but also the best return on investment. And that's what's been the greatest so far with working with Nature's is, is the, the customer support. We're really, really pleased with that.